have done is sacked 800 workers and they've employed agency workers, some of whom are being paid £1.81 an hour. Let's just take that in for a minute. £1.81 an hour. I mean, the P&O boss said on average it's £5.50 yeah, an hour. Yeah, he may have said on average, but some are on £1.81 an hour. And £5 an hour is, of course, half the, more or less half the national minimum wage. Now, what this tells us is here we have a company that has gone to the British Parliament, admitted it's broke the law, doesn't care, because it knows it's not going to face any consequences. And what we have to do is to say this must stop. So my challenge to the Minister tonight is to say, why can't you agree these simple basic steps? First of all, P&O must be forced to reinstate every single one of the 800 workers without any loss of pay. Secondly, until they do that, the government will cancel all contracts with the parent company DP World, who make billions of pounds worth of profits. And thirdly, if it is the case that P&O Ferries is part of a critical national infrastructure that disproportionately ferries people from Britain into Europe, and this is the way they behave, that company should be nationalised, the state should own critical national infrastructure, and then this wouldn't happen. So we need stronger laws, we need to outlaw fire and hire of British firms who are doing it as we speak, and we need to force this company to comply or we will take them off the route by whatever means that takes. And I'll tell you why this is so important. If we don't do that, other companies will follow suit. And other companies won't just sack their workers and pay them less. They will sack their workers and exploit laws and pay people, let's just take this in, £1.81 an hour. Mm. You should get more than that doing a paper round as a child, let alone for critically carrying out duties that ferry people from Britain to the UK. It's not only a disgrace, it is on your watch and you are responsible for the undermining of trade union rights and workers' rights and this is the price you pay. You should be ashamed, but you should also do something real about it immediately.